This intersection at 225 and 17th place quickly becoming dangerous for Aurora drivers. I have an injury on my neck, a broken left wrist, two dislocated shoulders. That's just Sandy Mina's upper body. Two weeks ago, she was driving this SUV to work, exiting southbound 225 when police say a driver going westbound on 17th place toward Fitzsimmons ran a red light. So eventually I'm definitely going to need a hip replacement and it's hard to find out at 26. These are photos of Sandy after the crash. She also has a broken arm and eight broken ribs. 7 News confirming nine accidents here since the intersection opened in February including a deadly crash in April that killed two, including a baby girl, and a crash this past Saturday, cracking this concrete barrier. Do you think that's a dangerous intersection? I didn't think so until I heard about all these accidents. Nine in seven months, is that a lot? Uh, it's high enough to certainly get our attention, yes. Lieutenant Jeff Turner met with a traffic engineer this afternoon to talk about options to make the intersection safer. Is it a sight line issue? The accidents are occurring because people are running the red light. In the meantime, police will be watching and issuing red light tickets. Anything they can do to help, you know, and prevent stuff like this from happening.